made during this broadcast regarding products or the claims made about specific products have not been evaluated by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. Products and treatments discussed are not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent disease. Make your physician aware of all nutritional supplements used and immediately notify your physician if you have any health concern or undiagnosed sign or symptom. Let's Talk Nutrition is a health talk show that features scientists, authors, nutrition specialists, personal trainers, holistic healers, and experts in traditional, natural, and integrative medicine. Listen for a chance to win daily prizes and follow Let's Talk Nutrition on Facebook and Instagram at Let's Talk Nutrition or on Twitter at LTN Radio. It's time for some inspiration. Tune in to get fit and healthy. It's time to talk about nutrition. Nutrition for your body, your mind, your spirit. It's time to talk about proper exercise, stress relief, eating well, and supplementation to help. Get ready to take charge of your health because your health is your wealth and the wealth of those who care about and love you. It's time for Let's Talk Nutrition with Dr. Michael Garko. Welcome to the show. And welcome to the show. Thanks for tuning in to Let's Talk Nutrition. Hope you're having a good day wherever and however you may be listening or watching the show and whatever you may be doing. And, um, we got a full crew in here today. Uh, Gary's on this side of the glass with me. Katie's on the other side, and Dr. Bird is in studio with us. So it's all good, and you're there. Most importantly, <laughs> otherwise, why would we be here? <laughs> you're not there. I'm staying home. <laughs> um, there is so much going on. Uh, so many different threads and themes that are trending. I didn't know. Uh, some day, sometimes news, the news day is abysmal. Other days, it's a such abundance. You know, you don't know what to what to what to put on the dinner table first. Um, but Dr. Bird is in studio, which is good, and she uh, is one of the educators and representative spokespeople for um, Silver Biotics. That's the silver product to go to. Hands down, I have, I have more. I have silver bi, silver biotics products in every bathroom in the house, <laughs> <laughs> in the studio, in the kitchen. I have them everywhere. Yeah, and you'll see why. Uh, they do have. It, I never thought that I would um, be be so laudatory about a silver based product because. I had a bias years ago. It was all the crazy claims that were being made about silver and, you know, people turning blue because they were making that stuff in a bathtub at home or something. <laughs> that was what they were doing. I mean, I just thought it was a bunch of hocus pocus. It's come a long way. And um, Dr. Keith M um, Mueller um, with Silver Biotics has uh, put the company on a research path. Mm -hmm. So it's more science-based now, and that, and that makes me comfortable because I, I can look at some data. And that, come on here and share. What I try to do is share with you what I, you know, you don't have time to do this. This is my job. I root around looking for stories and studies, looking for therapies, you know, trying to, get a, great, a better understanding of what's happening in our culture, generally our food culture. This is a health talk show, but it's a show about life. So everything in my view is fair game. So that's, that's my approach and to be open-minded. And I try to take a Renaissance approach to this, um, where it's art and science, both, if you will, um, embracing both. Because oftentimes, uh, health, wellness, and well-being is an art and a science. Mm -hmm. And so you have to, I think it's just a better way to go at this than to be highly parochial and, um, um, you know, I don't know. You get too ideological about stuff. You know, this is the way, this theory and only this theory or this, this therapy and only this therapy this treatment and only this treatment. No, man, it doesn't work like that. So staying open-minded and not uh, falling prey to the temptation of uh, staying in your comfort zone and only talking about things that probably make you feel, you meaning me, feel good. 
I mean, we're everywhere. We're we're across the spectrum of talking about health stuff. I mean, we what show brings on the impossible whopper to talk about it as a health conscious idea? Yeah. Um, and I was talking about that yesterday with somebody in the health store. Um, we had, you know, the a CEO and, um, chairperson for quality dining. What was it? Dave? Yep. You're right. Quality, quality dining. dining, quality dining for Burger King. Nice man. Um, Mr. Fitzpatrick, and um, had him on. We kept him on for a half hour. Uh, I didn't do an ambush sir, uh, interview with him. <laughs> Some of my colleagues would have. They would have pulled a Mike Wallace on him. Mm-hmm. You know, you know, come, come on in. Come on in. Have a seat. Next thing you know, they're handing your head in your hand. Is put in your head. Your head is put in your hands. No, I don't do that. That's not nice. Um, so we, we he he. He alluded to the idea that he said, he said, if I have the honor of coming back on your show in a few months from now, I'll be able to maybe talk about some other plant-based products at Burger King. The biggest irony, I think, of this narrative is that you have a fast food company probably making the concept of plant-based eating more popular than the people in the natural products industry. Yeah. So you can't make that up. Uh, is there room for improvement? Absolutely. I think that that impossible whopper, uh, they, 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 there are things that they could do to make it even better, healthier. Reduce the sodium. They're using soy right now. Perhaps another. They w- Knowing food scientists as I do uh, and these companies, they'll mess with it they're, they're, mm-hmm. as we speak. As we speak. Well, he alluded to it that they were going to, Weak it a little. They, they have to. This is the first generation uh, impossible whopper. So yeah. <laughs> the, the next uh, impossible whopper 2.0 will be coming out. <laughs> G5 whopper. The G5 whopper. <laughs> um, and I was telling Dr. Bird, uh, Dr. Bird, welcome to this. Welcome it's to great me. to be here. Thank you. Nice to have you. I told uh, Dr. Bird, I said, I, haven't, I didn't have a whopper in my hands maybe 40 years. 40 years? I don't even remember when. I have no clue. I have no memory. And I have a damn good memory. I, I don't remember ever. I just have no memory. It's been that long. It's decades. And I didn't realize how big, how big the thing is. It looked like a hubcap on a Fiat. <laughs> <laughs> it's a whopper, I was, right? I was good until I smelled it. I was. I was no, like, oh, I'm not going to have one. Katie said, Katie said to Gary, would you? You want you want one? No, no, don't want it. Okay, so she places the order. They come in, and then she, Katie, being generous, cuts hers in half because Gary wanted some. It was good. It was good, and Katie made that all happen. She, I don't know where she found right. that. She found that guy. I just dropped the idea to her and Gary. I said I would love to have Burger King on here. I was just, you know, I thought I ain't gonna happen. Next thing I know, yeah. boom. She yeah. worked on it. She got it. She got it done. So thanks to Katie. Yeah, we're we happy should, to do it. We'll see. Maybe we get McDonald's on here. <laughs> Fast food wars. Um, Mick Impossible. They have, they have, they, they launched a plant-based burger. Um, it was in another country the same day the Whopper was launched. The Impossible Whopper was la- launched nationally. I forget which country they did it in. They're working on it. Now, you know, as I said, fast food, the fast food industry, the fast food subculture is here to stay. That is correct. It's not going, it's not going to disappear. You're not going to legislate it out of business. You're not going to shame them out of business. Uh, People like it. People want it. It's, it's food for them. And they're, but the, these companies are smart, Dr. Bird. There is more consumer demand. It is 90% of meat eaters want a plant-based version. It's not the it's not yeah, the it's vegans not and the, the vegans, vegans yeah. <laughs> that are pushing for this. It's, they want options. Right. That's what the research shows. Mm-hmm. So these companies are smart. They're adapting. 
salads, salad bars. Yeah. You know. They're a lot better than they used to be. Oh, my God, yes. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I remember you used to walk into this place. All you could, there was so much grease, it was be on the floor, you'd slip and fall. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back. Drink mix for a quick and easy way to support immunity. Kyolic Immune Formula 103 combines immune boosting nutrients with aged garlic extract. Aged garlic extract has been clinically shown to support a healthy immune response and reduce both the duration and severity of cold and flu symptoms. Help me protect you with Kyolic supplements and nutritional drink mixes to fortify your immune health today. Available at fine natural health retailers. The science of psychology tells us there is a connection between looking more attractive and having more self-confidence. One way to look more attractive is to have healthy looking hair. Ridgecrest Herbal's award-winning Hair Revive can support healthy, attractive hair. Hair Revive is formulated with a stress-fighting complex, hair growth ingredients, a hormone balancing complex, and Chinese herbs. Taken together, the ingredients in Hair Revive promote hair growth, encourage healthier, thicker looking hair, and support recovery from damaging hairstyling techniques, harsh chemicals, and daily stress. So start looking more attractive with healthier, thicker, and shinier hair with Ridgecrest Herbals Hair Revive. Visit rcherbals.com for more information or call 1-800-242-4649 and mention this ad. That's 1-800-242-4649. This is Dr. Michael Garka, host of the nationally syndicated health talk show, Let's Talk Nutrition. Way too often, dietary supplements cost way too much. Not so at Vitamin Discount Center. Here's why. BDC sells leading national brands up to 50% off MSRP every day. Competitors' prices are matched for identical products with proof of price. If you're in the military or are a first responder, you get an additional 10% off BDC's already discounted prices. BDC even offers case discounts. And you can get connected with BDC's VIP mobile text program for additional savings and customer rewards throughout the month. The choice is clear. You can save at Vitamin Discount Center. For a store nearest you, visit vitamindiscountcenter.com or call 813-907-7066. That's 813-907-7066. Vitamin Discount Center. For life, for less. Want to get at the core issues that make weight loss so difficult? Try PGX from Natural Factors. This revolutionary product is clinically shown to help people achieve their ideal body weight in a safe, natural way. PGX helps you feel full for hours, dramatically reduces the glycemic index of any food or meal, and ultimately causes the release of the compounds that achieve two important goals in weight loss. One, telling your brain that you're satisfied so you eat less, and two, improving the action of the hormone insulin. As medical doctor Mark Hyman said in his best-selling book, Eat Fat, Get Thin, if you choose to use only one supplement, PGX is the most important. If you've ever tried to lose weight and failed, you need the tremendous support of PGX from Natural Factors. For more information on making your weight loss dream a near effortless reality, visit pgx.com. Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by CV Sciences, from seed to shelf. Form Essentials, makers of the Sleep Aid Solace. North American Herb and Spice, wellness for life. Natural Factors, where great health begins. New chapter, the benefit of nature's wisdom. Yerba Prima, pioneers in internal cleansing. 
Let's Talk Nutrition on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. And thank you for uh, tuning in today, uh, listening and watching LTN. We are around the corner, around the country, and around the globe. Uh, that's because of technology. Uh, our affiliates across the U.S. from coast to coast, uh, north and south, up and down, left and right, uh, that is heart and soul of this show. But uh, there's other technology, and we ask that you support your local radio station that airs uh, Let's Talk Nutrition and the kind of programming that uh, serves the community and helping them in their, with their health, their physical health, financial health, spiritual health. Radio, radio is an amazing medium. It's, it has endured and survived all this upheaval in technolo technology. It's incredible. And then, of course, we stream every day. And we have a podcast, and I'm told that we have how many? Was, was it 54,000 listens or something like yeah, that? Yeah, 54. 54,000 listens on the podcast, over 70,000 views on uh, YouTube, and we get 30,000 hits a day on the stream globally. Most of, most of it's loaded in uh, North America. So it's all good, thanks to you. Dr. Sally Bird is in studio today. Dr. Bird, yesterday uh, we had Dr. Buick on, uh, Patrick Buick. He's a researcher in Cape Town, South Africa. I uh, happen to have a lot of re regard for Dr. Buick. And we were talking about ModuCare, that product from mm -hmm. um, that Wakanaga of America distributes. ModuCare has been around since the 90s. Dr. Buick was involved in the development of the product. And I was talking, I gave three concrete examples yesterday <clears throat> of how the environment is indeed toxic and polluted. And I, was, I made the observation that oftentimes when I talk about this on air, it seems like an abstraction. It's abstract. And I gave three very real concrete examples. Like, for example, right now in Newark, New mm -hmm, Jersey, mm -hmm. in the United States of America, we now have echoes of Flint. There's lead in the water. Yeah. yeah. <clears throat> okay? Mm -hmm. And that's real. That's not a statistic. These, these are, you know, people in New Jersey and Newark are concerned. And I asked Dr. Buick, what's the relationship between this, intox this toxic planet and world that we live in day to day and our immune system? This is where silver biotics now comes into play as well. And made the argument that if there was ever a time when you need an immune system to be robust and alert and on duty, that sentinel of your body, now is that time. Not, I mean, now is that time. People are getting sick from related to environmental causes, not genetics necessarily all the time. And in fact, there's ep and Dr. Buick mentioned epigenetics mm -hmm. and how certain conditions in the environment will trigger the genes right. to express That's right. that mm -hmm. are potential for cancer or some other disease. And so that's where Modicare uh, would serve a good purpose, right? Yes. And as I thought about it, so would silver biotics fall into that same, same space. Mm. Taking silver biotics is protection uh, and it's prevention and preparation. It, it's, it protects you against your, um, these environmental, um, potentially environmental um, triggers that threaten your health. And now is more than ever, we need that um, as, a, as a individuals, as a group, society, as a country. Um, it's an insurance policy for your immune system. It is. It is an insurance policy, and there's no slick insurance man selling, no, you, selling you the policy. <laughs> <laughs> it's Dr. Bird. <laughs> so that's what we talked about. Excellent. And I wanted to pick that up with you. The Silver Biotics products, and you have an array of them, the, the one, this one, or the immune system, the liquid. The liquid. I, I took a, you know, I 
You swig it every day. On yeah, the you, 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 you <laughs> she, Dr. Bird came in, and I have it off to the right here in the studio, and she put it in front of me for the show. I take Cheers. A, and it, and it just, just tastes like water. How does this, how does this relate to the immune system, and how would it help people in our day-to-day life cope with this very toxic world that we live in? That's a great question. Um, Silver biotics, most people just know it for colds, flu, take it occasionally when they feel something coming on. However, when it's consumed on a daily basis, your body is stronger, just as you mentioned, Dr. Garko, for everyday health stresses. Whether you eat in a restaurant and there may be salmonella on alfalfa sprouts or even in lettuce, or there could be an outbreak with chicken or spinach or whatever, or you may be consuming some water with heavy metals in it. You could be exposed to sick people. You could be touching computer screens, uh, cell phones um, that uh, a person with a virus condition had touched that could be passed along to you. You could just be tired, stressed out, have emotional issues. Sure. So when you drink the silver, your body doesn't have to fight the toxin as much because your organs are working like they're supposed to be working. And our bodies are made to handle and we can adapt well. Sure. So you mentioned a recall. Yes. Dole, yep. the food company, uh, has a recall on spinach. Mm. Uh, mm-hmm. Some baby Dole spinach products have been recalled due to possible, our little, <laughs> uh, little friendly uh, pathogenic B- bacterium salmonella can- contamination to your point that's right and when we come back another point about the toxic world what about the fish how and why are they so toxic now don't be stressed out or anxious take hemp and all.
And welcome back. Welcome to Let's Talk Nutrition. All I see is uh, the top of Katie's head. <laughs> That's it. She has long hair, and she has it up in a bun, and all I see is the bun because she's hidden behind the computers. She's <laughs> it looks funny. I mean, if you're sitting over here, Katie, it's, it's odd. Uh, right, Dr. You Bert? just have to put a poster of her, like, right in front of the window. <laughs> Like in China, they have they have these giant billboards now of sunset and sunrises because the pollution so bad people yes. haven't people don't see them very often. So no. they, they remind them that there is, after all, a sunrise and a sunset. So that's what we'll do. We'll we'll, we'll get a big uh, blow up poster of Katie and put up on the glass. I can see her. <laughs> oh yeah, Gary's here. Doctor Bird's in studio, and of course, um, Katie is on the other uh, on the other side of the glass. Eight seven seven eight nine seven eight two five five. Toxic Planet. That that theme uh-huh. carried over from yesterday. Fish may become more toxic than ever. Killing and me, may, killing me. Okay. Um, and people get upset with me. They, you know, they because I don't. I'm not a big proponent of people eating fish three and four times a week. I'm not. Why? It's the methyl mercury. Many species of fish now. Uh, that are on the plates of people all over the world <laughs> um, are now being recorded as having higher levels of methyl mercury, which is so toxic. And the question is, why? Why is this happening? Why are the fish becoming more contaminated? Mm. Harvard University uh, might provide some insight. Now, methyl mercury is a type of mercury and a very toxic compound. It, if, it, it often forms through mercury's contact with bacteria from different environments, methyl mercury. This is interesting. Get the, these microbes again involved. Often, more often than not, and I'm giving credit to medical news today, people uh, become exposed to methyl mercury by consuming fish and seafood on a regular basis. Right, two, three, four times a week. Mm. Now, uh, <laughs> many of these fish live in the sea, but also get exposed to methyl mercury through what? Through their diet. It's not necessarily right. the water itself, although it is contaminated. What do they eat? Algae. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Algae, as it turns out, absorbs more organic methyl mercury. So the fish that eat the algae will absorb more methyl mercury because there's more mer- methyl mercury in the water. Can't make this up. So it, you see how the food chain, the fish eat the algae, we eat the fish. Hmm. And when the larger fish at the top of the food chain, they will eat these fish that ate the contaminated mercury. So now they become contaminated because they may not eat the algae directly, but they're eating the smaller fish that ate the algae that was contaminated with methyl methyl mercury. So in this way, fish and other creatures who are at the top of the food chain end up accumulating more and more methyl mercury. So it's so interconnected. And we are part of the system. So to the point now, Go back to where we started, yes. Doctor Bird. Um, it, your immune system critical it, more than ever critical. before. I think critical. more than ever before, and you can't assume that just because you're young and your immune system is robust that it's necessarily going to protect you, because you could be carrying a toxic burden of these chemicals that is so profoundly stressing your systems of your body. No matter how healthy you think you are, you still need help. Absolutely. That's why even um, any of us who have been on nutrition programs for a long time, when you add the silver in, it is an insurance policy for your body. And if you're going to be consuming anything, eating out, you're not really safe anywhere anymore. You could go to the fish market, cook at home. You could eat out even at a fast food restaurant. You've got to protect yourself. When you've got a lower load of toxins on your body, your system can fight some of the bad stuff. Right. It can't fight it if it's bombarded with 50 things. It's like an army. 
That's right. If you got an enemy that has more troops than you do, you're going to get defeated. Right. Right? So you need help. So even if you're eating seafood or especially sushi, you have to take silver because it will eradicate bacteria in a couple of minutes. You're not going to get sick. Um, The mercury issue, one of the foods that we recommend um, from my mentor stock is um, cilantro because it can bind mercury up. So, uh, there was a story trending about 10 days ago. I never got to it. I had, I pulled it yeah. on cilantro. I was going to talk. Cilantro, coriander, which is the seed of cilantro. And if you mix the silver with spices, the body can do so much because we have amazing bodies. So we can be stronger. So food combining when you eat certain foods is also critical. What do you put on the fish? So in this... <clears throat> Pardon me. In this Harvard study, they were clever. Mm -hmm. Uh, The researchers had three decades worth of data on the ecosystem of the Gulf of Maine in the Atlantic Ocean. Mm. And in their work, in their analytical work, they studied what two main predators ate from the 70s to the 2000s. The two main predators that they looked at were Atlantic cod and spiny dogfish, which I have never consumed. Cod, yes. <laughs> the, the findings indicated that for cod, methyl mercury levels decreased by 6 to 20% since the 1970s. In contrast, the toxic compound, the levels of this toxic compound have increased by 33 to 61% in spiny dogfish. The researchers, and I'm giving again credit to Medical News Today, the researchers explained this intriguing contrast, they said, by looking at what each species was able to eat throughout the decades. The Harvard researchers noted that in the 1970s, the herring population, prey for both cod and dogfish, decreased significantly in the Gulf of Maine due to overfishing. Thus, each of those predator species had to turn to other sources of food. So cod started preying primarily on shads and sardines, which are smaller fish and have lower levels of methylmercury. That's why Mm -hmm. the the methylmercury, what the cod ate, they were eating less contaminated fish. Yeah. Spiny dogfish, not so much. The science of psychology tells us there is a connection between looking more attractive and having more self-confidence. One way to look more attractive is to have healthy looking hair. Ridgecrest Herbal's award-winning Hair Revive can support healthy, attractive hair. Hair Revive is formulated with a stress-fighting complex, hair growth ingredients, a hormone balancing complex, and Chinese herbs. Taken together, the ingredients in Hair Revive promote hair growth, encourage healthier, thicker looking hair, and support recovery from damaging hairstyling techniques, harsh chemicals, and daily stress. So start looking more attractive with healthier, thicker, and shinier hair with Ridgecrest Herbals Hair Revive. Visit rcherbals.com for more information or call 1-800-242-4649 and mention this ad. That's 1-800-242-4649. The latest trend to hit the store shelves has the whole country buzzing. 
Cannabidiol, or CBD, might just be the greatest discovery of our generation. And it comes from a plant that is not so new, agricultural hemp. Yes, after 70 years of prohibition and misunderstanding, hemp is back to help you stay healthy and balanced. Growing research is showing that we have a lot to learn from the remarkable hemp plant. Nutrient-rich products like Plus CBD Oil's Total Plant Complex concentrated products provide broad-spectrum nutrition, including fatty acids, plant sterols, cannabinoids, terpenes, and naturally occurring vitamin E. From seed to shelf, all Plus CBD Oil products provide the highest quality hemp-derived CBD products available and are offered in a variety of delivery systems and flavors to suit your needs. Ask your local independent health food store about Plus CBD Oil products by CV Sciences today and learn more about the CBD evolution at pluscbdoil.com. That's pluscbdoil.com. Did you know that you have three brains? Yes, you heard right. Exciting new research reveals you have three brains, your head brain, your heart brain, and your gut brain. These three brains are like an orchestra with billions of neurons working together to create a harmonic symphony. This intricate relationship between these three brains impacts your mental, emotional, and physical health. The Three Brain Supplements from Natural Factors is a bold new innovation in mental health. It provides a whole body approach to balance brain health and well-being. Start with the Three Brains Total Kit, which includes five supplements that are essential for three brain health. The kit provides foundational support for all three of your brains. Then, depending on your unique needs, choose from higher thoughts to enhance brain performance, mental sunshine for healthy mood balance, serene mind to relieve stress-related fatigue, or the best sleep for restful sleep. Learn more at 3brainshealth.com. This is Dr. Michael Garka, host of the nationally syndicated health talk show, Let's Talk Nutrition. Way too often, dietary supplements cost way too much. Not so at Vitamin Discount Center. Here's why. BDC sells leading national brands up to 50% off MSRP every day. Competitors' prices are matched for identical products with proof of price. If you're in the military or are a first responder, you get an additional 10% off BDC's already discounted prices. BDC even offers case discounts. And you can get connected with BDC's VIP mobile text program for additional savings and customer rewards throughout the month. The choice is clear. You can save at Vitamin Discount Center. For a store nearest you, visit vitamindiscountcenter.com or call 813-907-7066. That's 813-907-7066. Vitamin Discount Center. For life, for less. Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by Jaro Formulas, superior nutrition and formulation. Natural factors where great health begins. Kyolic, aging makes the finest garlic truly odorless. Celsius, live fit. Flora, 100 years of herbal wisdom. Let's Talk Nutrition on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. So uh, it's interesting how we end up eating contaminated food, in particular fish. <clears throat> the fish have to eat too, right? Mm -hmm. So they can, uh, the larger predators will eat smaller fish. The smaller fish eat algae and maybe a smaller fish yet. So the algae has this propensity to absorb uh, methylmercury. So when the fish on the lower end of the food chain eat the algae, the prey eat the now contaminated fish. Cod, uh, in a study by ha Harvard, the methylmercury levels have decreased by 6 to 20% since the 70s. Why? Because they changed the predators. The cod is a predator. Mm. Uh, changed its diet. <laughs> um, it, uh, cod started preying on primarily shads and sardines. These are smaller fish and have typically lower levels of methylmercury. Why? Because they have less muscle, less fat. So they don't absorb these toxic chemicals. As a result, cod's methylmercury has decreased. However, you have the spiny dogfish 
that looks like a miniature shark in a way, started preying on squid and cephalopods. They are predators also, but they have high levels of methylmercury than herring do. This new diet led to an increase in methylmercury levels in the spiny dogfish. Spiny dog, we did some quick, a quick and dirty look, a research look at what are spiny dogfish served all over the planet. Um, it's, a, it's a bottom feeder. So here we are now. This is yet another concrete example. And I'm trying to take it out of the abstract. This is a, yet another concrete example of this toxic planet and the, no pun intended, downstream consequences. Your immune system is your first line of defense. Mm-hmm. Not the medications. Notice I said first line. Mm-hmm. If it's compromised and you're immunosuppressed, or even if you're healthy and are subjected to all these insults, Dr. Bird makes the argument that it's to the army, your immune army is expanded and expanded and extended and gets expended and you don't have enough forces to fight all of the potential um, bacteria, viruses, and whatnot. Yeast and mold also. Yeast, mold. Big things. Big deals, right? Mm -hmm. Dr. Um, Ingram comes on, talks about this all the time. So silver biotics, and I, Norman, uh, silver biotics, then serves the purpose of what? Well, it can neutralize bacteria in a couple of minutes. It can prevent a virus from reproducing. So, you know, fish even have viruses. You know, so you gotta um, protect yourself. It doesn't amplify, it's not an adaptogen. It doesn't amplify or downregulate the immune system. It all it does is it support- takes out the garbage, Doc. In other words, it's, so it's reduced. You know what they're like? You know what this product is like? It's like. It's a filtering system. Yeah. People can imagine that. It's kind of a natural filtration system. It's removing some of the threats that That's the body right. has to deal with, the immune system has right. to deal with, so the immune system can focus on. It actually on, works. Yeah. <laughs> it's not overburdened. 877 897 8255. Katie, we had a caller. Uh, could you explain? She just wanted you to talk about um, eating fish in pregnancy. No. No, no, don't do it. <laughs> don't do it. Okay. Don't do it. You're, you're, Dr. Bird. I ate very little fish. I always tell that uh, to ladies who want to eat fish, sardines or anchovies. That's it. And make sure you have parsley, cilantro, basil, some type of spice or herb with it to neutralize any of the metals. Now people are going to get mad at me, and and you know doctors maybe when I I said that so quickly and so categorically. No, what the mother eats, what the mother drinks, mm-hmm. so mm-hmm. does the so does the fetus. Right, that is true. Well, I'm not going to get pregnant. Not not lately. No, um, but and silver is safe for pregnant women. It is one of their best friends while a, a mom is a woman is pregnant. What about after the baby is born? Perfect. Really? The baby will thrive on silver. It'll actually, because it doesn't kill the probiotics, remember. Uh, nursing moms? Nursing moms. It's beautiful. So for a woman who's pregnant, you want to eat fish. You may not like the way they smell and taste, but it's sardines and anchovies. What about smelts? I haven't eaten. Small fish, those are lake fish. Those are usually pretty healthy, yeah, like yeah. a herring. The, mm-hmm. the smaller the fish, the lower the, on the food chain. Yes, better. Typically, mm. the better. However, they're eating the algae, which is now contaminated with methylmercury. So, even there, it's risky business. Um, I like Crown Prince brand of sardines mm. and um, anchovies. Mm-hmm. Very good product. If you wash the salt off the anchovies and use some lemon juice and olive oil with them on a salad, they are quite them. tasty. Put on your pizza. Oh, man. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I love anchovies. Um, yeah. If you're, according to the, if you go to ewg.org, you can find a guide. It's called the EWG's Consumer Guide to Seafood. 
Uh, it's very helpful. E -W, Environmental Working Group, EWG.org. They have a consumer guide to seafood. They claim that they, their best bets are wild salmon. I don't agree with that. Sardines, yes. Mussels, rainbow trout, and Atlantic mackerel. The high in omega-3s, low in mercury. Um, they say one to two to one to, or two four ounce servings a week of these fish have a little mercury and optimal levels of omega three fatty acids for pregnant or nursing women and people with heart disease. Mm -hmm. So that's wild salmon, sardines, mussels, rainbow trout, Atlantic mackerel. Good choices: high in omega three, low in mercury. Anchovies, uh, Pollock and uh, Imitation crab, I don't know what that is. Mm. And herring. These species have favorable concentrations of omega-3s. One four-ounce serving provides at least 25% of the weekly recommended omega-3 consumption. A pregnant woman of average weight could eat three four-ounce servings per week. Uh, low mercury. Shrimp, catfish, tilapia, mm -hmm. uh, scallops. But they're also low in omega-3. Tilapia is a... Not yeah, tilapia, uh, don't recommend it. A lot of it's coming from Asia. Canned light albacore tuna. <laughs> they, can't, they contain too much mercury. Mm -hmm. Halibut, lobster, mahi-mahi, sea bass. These things glow in the dark. Stay away from them. We'll be back. Talk Nutrition, LLC. The Rays play on Tampa Bay Sports Radio, WDAE. To the wall, it's gone! Catch every pitch of Rays baseball in Pinellas and Hillsboro on 95.3 FM. And all over Tampa Bay on 620 AM. Rays up. Now, this week's top TV streams. Here's what you've been watching on TV this week. Entering the countdown at number five is Pose, the period piece musical drama on FX. The Cody family keeps fighting the law and each other as TNT's crime drama Animal Kingdom clocks in at number four. It's a mostly new cast, but there's still drama on the party boat with Bravo's third place, Below Deck Mediterranean. Inching up a place to number two is MTV's sequel slash reboot, The Hills New Beginnings, which was renewed for a second season. And in the top spot yet again is Hannah's search for love on ABC's The Bachelorette, your number one TV stream. That's this week's top TV streams on iHeartRadio. 
50 wins. WHNZ, Tampa Bay. Available everywhere you want to listen on our free iHeartRadio app. Download it now. This is CBS News on the Hour. Real news, real reporting. I'm Deborah Rodriguez. Lots of airline passengers with nowhere to go in Hong Kong. <laughs> Pro-democracy demonstrators have flooded the terminals again. Correspondent Deborah Pata is there. For a second consecutive day, there's confusion and chaos at the airport. Many flights have been disrupted. Today, we're seeing protesters occupy both the departures and the arrival sections of the airport. And this is causing huge disruptions as travelers try to get in. The stock market is soaring on late breaking news. The Trump administration will delay new tariffs on Chinese products. Until December 15th, the Dow is now up 418 points. We're just in from police in Malaysia. Her family has identified the body of an Irish teenager who disappeared near a resort nine days ago. Her parents say she climbed out the open window of their cottage. The head of U.S. Special Operations Command is ordering an ethics review after a string of recent incidents involving alleged misconduct and bad behavior among Navy SEALs. CBS News military consultant Mike Lyons. This review is going to allow them to reinforce a foundation of trust throughout uh, every rank uh, in, in order to how uh, operators are educated, how they're trained, and then how they fundamentally deploy downrange. They're going to address ethical failures when they occur and make sure people learn from them. A bipartisan congressional investigation is getting underway into Jeffrey Epstein's apparent suicide in his New York City jail cell. The Justice Department has opened its own probe after reports no one had checked on the accused child sex trafficker for hours before he was found unresponsive. CBS News legal analyst Ricky Kleeman. You have guards, one of them, one of whom was really not a correctional officer at that point. Their excuses, they were very understaffed. They were working multiple overtimes. And so what that tells me is they were asleep. Attorney General William Barr also promises to pursue the sex trafficking case and possible accomplices. New hope in the fight against Ebola. Dr. Anthony Fauci at the National Institute of Allergy and Infectious Diseases. We've only had standard of care, treating people for their blood loss, their fluid loss. Now we have two specific treatments that are directed against the virus itself. CNN sticking by Chris Cuomo with video making the rounds of its evening host, launching into an expletive lace tirade against a man who called him Fredo from the movie Godfather. You're going to have a problem. What? what are you going to do about it? I'll ruin you. Fredo is an insult to Italian Americans. It references the character Fredo Corleone, Vito's dim witted son in the movie. This is CBS News. CBS News Radio is your home for breaking news. With our team of reporters around the country and the world, we give you the coverage you can trust. Eye on Veterans Heroes, presented by University of Maryland, University College. The Marine Corps briefly experimented with integrating females into boot camp. Retired Lieutenant Colonel Kate Germano is speaking out, encouraging the Marine Corps to do more. A lot of people will not let the Marine Corps off the hook, and I'm hoping that they do better. At UMUC, serving the military is in our DNA, and we can help you build the confidence you need to set your post-military career in motion. Learn more at umuc.edu. Are you more than $10,000 in debt? Feel like you're on a never-ending treadmill, staying in one place and never getting ahead with those minimum payments? Don't let the credit card companies bully you anymore. There are programs in place to help you get free of your debt, and you don't have to pay the entire amount you owe. The program at Total Financial Freedom can help you get debt-free in months instead of decades. Call Total Financial now at 800-899-8922. That's 800-899-8922. The headlines are ready. The Bucks are the pro champions of the world. The Lightning has won the Stanley Cup. The Rays are going to the World Series. Here's to all the great moments we've shared. Kevin Longoria has just hit the Rays to the American League Wild Card. And all the great moments we've yet to share. Bucks win. Bucks win. Live in the moment. Rays win. Tampa Bay Sports Radio. The Lightning win it. 620 WDAE. 5.3 FM. 
Let's Talk Nutrition is streaming on your Amazon Echo device. Just say, Alexa, play 1250 WHNZ from iHeartRadio. 1250 wins WHNZ Tampa. We are looking for westbound on I-4 from the Selma Connector in the 275. Watch for a crash on Channel Side Drive at 2nd Avenue East. There's a wreck on Woodbridge Boulevard at Northbridge Boulevard. And in Manatee, there's a wreck on the northbound I-75 ramp to US-301 in the left lane. See traffic problems? Call the injury firm of Abrahamson and Utrecht Hillsborough Traffic Tip Line at 866-545-9595. This report is sponsored by Indeed.com. Indeed, used by over 3 million businesses for hiring, where business owners and HR professionals can post job openings with screener questions, then sort, review, and communicate with candidates from an online dashboard. Learn more at Indeed.com slash hire. The following is a commercial program paid for by Let's Talk Nutrition, LLC. The opinions, viewpoints, and promises made during the following program are not those of WHNZ AM, its staff, management, or parent company, iHeartMedia Incorporated. Statements made during this broadcast regarding products or the claims made about specific products have not been evaluated by the U.S. Food and Drug Administration. Products and treatments discussed are not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent disease. Make your physician aware of all nutritional supplements used and immediately notify your physician if you have any health concern or undiagnosed sign or symptom. Let's Talk Nutrition is a health talk show that features scientists, authors, nutrition specialists, personal trainers, holistic healers, and experts in traditional, natural, and integrative medicine. Listen for a chance to win daily prizes and follow Let's Talk Nutrition on Facebook and Instagram at Let's Talk Nutrition or on Twitter at LTN Radio. It's time for some inspiration. Tune in to get fit and healthy. It's time to talk about nutrition. Nutrition for your body, your mind, your spirit. It's time to talk about proper exercise, stress relief, eating well, and supplementation to help. Get ready to take charge of your health because your health is your wealth and the wealth of those who care about and love you. It's time for Let's Talk Nutrition with Dr. Michael Garko. Welcome to the show. Hey, everybody. Welcome back to Let's Talk Nutrition in studio with us is uh, Dr. Sally Bird. Dr. Bird is from American Biotech Labs. If you haven't checked out their website, it what's the website again, Dr. Bird? Silverbiotics.com. Okay, go out to silverbiotics.com, check it out. Don't forget, you can call in at 877-897-8255. That's 877-897-TALK. Dr. Garko's personal email is drgarko, letstalknutrition.com. Follow us, like us, and share us on Facebook at Let's Talk Nutrition, on Instagram at Let's Talk Nutrition, and subscribe to that YouTube channel where we have over 71,000 views, 1,200 videos, And everything's up there. It's closed caption for the hearing impaired, so you can uh, watch it and read along with us. Dr. Bird, welcome to Let's Talk Nutrition. Uh, Nice to have you in studio again today. Uh, Katie's behind the glass. Gary's on this side. uh, She's on one side. Gary's on this side. Dr. Bird's on this side. and uh, Hopefully, we won't get on the other side, (laughs) if you know what I mean. (laughs) Don't want to go there yet. Uh, (laughs) Um. Fish and contaminated fish, we were talking about that in the last block of the last hour. And um, I do recommend going to the Environmental Working Group's website, ewg.org, and look at their guide, their seafood guide. Uh, It's very, very helpful. Now, biomonitoring of industrial chemicals in humans, uh, especially tissues and fluids, has been going on for some time. And a researcher by the name of Thornton uh, and some of his colleagues did a study back in 2002. And they said that the biomonitoring of these industrial chemicals in human tissues and fluids, and I'm quoting them now, has shown that all people, all people, they said, not just those working in or living near major pollution sources, carry a body burden of synthetic chemicals in their blood, fat, mother's milk, semen, urine, and breath. Close quote. 
making, I guess now, the toxic industrial chemicals responsible for the body burden widespread. This is not science fiction. Uh, the a body, body burden, the definition of it, it, it's an intuitive definition, is the quantity of um, outside substances, exogenous substances, or, meta or metabolites that accumulate in, the, in your body. Simple as that. In less technical terms, body burden is the result of lifelong exposure to industrial chemicals used in the manufacture of thousands of consumer products found as lingering contaminants in food and environment, you know, air, water, and soil. This is real. And the more industrialized we have become, the, uh, the more contaminated we have become. The consequence. And the body burden is found in drinking water. The, the, the chemicals that, that create this body burden of, of distress, drinking water, your household air, dust, treated tap water and food, furniture. I mean, it, it's everywhere. Carpeting. I mean, you find it everywhere. Cleaning agents in the house that you're using, household products, you know, detergents, uh, insulation, fabric treatments, cosmetics, paints, upholstery, computers, televisions, at every, no matter what, these chemicals lurk and, and are there. And they get into our body. We have natural systems to, to detox the body, but the body is now so burdened with the chemicals mm -hmm. that it can't keep up. This is where stage left, Dr. Bird comes <laughs> in, and your answer is? <laughs> so we're biotic. And tell them why. And because it'll reduce the, the, the issues or the toxic burden. It allows the body to actually fight what it's got to fight without causing stress. Now. When we were when you were discussing about the toxic load from the fish doc about the um, mercury, and what we can do is is tell your listeners and viewers about sugar and yeast and mold that are also a big problem with environmental toxins, people's workplaces, even in cars, um, after storms, people have something leaking in a house. How many people have? moldy offices or the air conditioning just doesn't smell right. That happens a lot in the summer where you've got a lot of leaks. And what you, the silver biotics does is it kills the yeast, kills the sugar. So your kidneys can actually do their elimination process. Mm -hmm. It's critical for things like that. The silver biotics, this is your daily immune system support product that I'm holding up. Mm -hmm. if you're watching. This is a liquid. And how much do you recommend? Uh, two taking? teaspoons a day for maintenance, but say you were exposed to eating some of this spinach that we, we discussed. From Dole. Dole, three, ha, Dole has a recall. Right, a recall right. if you had a salmonella attack, three tablespoons for, uh, per day for at least a week, then you could cut back to a tablespoon a day. Yeah, I just measured it. I think it excellent, long, excellent. Yeah. Take <laughs> a swig. <laughs> a swig. A that's, a, I, that's my <laughs> dosage. Two swigs. <laughs> um, I, again, go to the Environmental Working Group. Mm -hmm. They wrote a report. It's called Body Burden, the Pollution in People. It's about, oh, 80 plus page report. Uh, you'll find it there. It is uh, Jan, uh, Jane Houlihan uh, and her colleagues um, did the report. It was a while back, um, 2003. But the report still has remarkable relevance. Uh, they report on a little uh, pilot study they did with nine subjects, regular people. Uh, these were not people that lived. These were volunteers. Um, the nine, none, of the, none of the nine volunteers worked with chemicals on the job. All had led healthy lives. Yet the nine subjects uh, contain an average of 91 compounds, 91, most of which did not exist 75, 80 years ago. In, the t in total, the nine subjects carried 76 chemicals linked to cancer. 
94 chemicals toxic to the brain and nervous system. 86 chemicals they found in their body that interfere with hormone system. 79 chemicals they found associated with birth defects or abnormal development in these people. 77 chemical toxic, chemicals toxic to reproduction, uh, reproductive system were in their bodies. 77, 77 chemicals toxic to the immune system were found in their bodies. These were everyday people. It was a little pilot study back then. And they report on it in this report. You can get it on the EWG website. It's free. It's called Body, Body Burden, the Pollution in People. It's worth a read. Uh, again, it's, it's hard to persuade people that this really exists, Dr. Bird. It is. And however, in addition to using products like Silver Biotics or the Kyolic, Magicare, the Wild Oregano, Doc, because all of those products work, they've got to, people have to understand what you eat helps also. And again, the cilantro, garlic, lemon, and there's a couple of algaes that can help fight your body, like chlorella and spirulina. So it's important to ingest some of these foods. The chemicals that they found in these, in these nine individuals in the pilot study affected their stomach and intestines, kidneys, mm-hmm. brain, nervous system, reproductive system, lungs, skin, liver, cardiovascular system, their hearing, their immune system, the reproductive system. These chemicals are real. They're dumped into the environment by the metric tons. Mm -hmm. And they just don't evaporate. They don't. And we're part of this ecosystem. We're not, it's all interconnected. So what's your first line of defense? First line of defense is have an immune system that's that's robust, vital, and vigilant. And you got to do everything you can to help it and help take the burden off your immune system. That's where silver biotics comes into play. That's tell LTN Coast to Coast and Globally Toxic Free. Check out Clear Lungs Immune and Clear Lungs Sport. Visit rcherbals.com or call 1-800-242-4649 and mention this ad to order the right Clear Lungs product for you. That's 1-800-242-4649. Is getting a good night's sleep a challenge? Fortunately, there's a superior fast-acting sleep formula called Tranquil Sleep from Natural Factors. This non-habit-forming supplement contains a unique combination of melatonin, 5-HTP, and L-theanine, which works in harmony with your body's natural sleep hormones. Tranquil Sleep can help you fall asleep, stay asleep, sleep sounder, and wake up refreshed, all without feeling drowsy in the morning. The key benefit comes from increasing the time spent in the deeper stages of sleep. It's only in these deeper levels of sleep that we truly experience the rejuvenation, regeneration, and recuperation that sleep provides. Even if you think you get a good night's sleep, give Tranquil Sleep a try. You might be surprised with how much better you've slept by waking up with more energy and enthusiasm to start your day. Learn more at naturalfactors.com. This is Dr. Michael Garka, host of the nationally syndicated health talk show, Let's Talk Nutrition. Way too often, dietary supplements cost way too much. Not so at Vitamin Discount Center. Here's why. BDC sells leading national brands up to 50% off MSRP every day. Competitors' prices are matched for identical products with proof of price. If you're in the military or are a first responder, you get an additional 10% off BDC's already discounted prices. BDC even offers case discounts. And you can get connected with BDC's VIP mobile text program for additional savings and customer rewards throughout the month. 
The choice is clear. You can save at Vitamin Discount Center. For a store nearest you, visit vitamindiscountcenter.com or call 813-907-7066. That's 813-907-7066. Vitamin Discount Center. For life, for less. Celsius is a fitness drink which is clinically proven to function. How? As a thermogenic, Celsius proprietary MetaPlus blend accelerates metabolism, increasing your body's ability to burn fat and calories. And there are only two ways a body burns fat through increased heart rate and our increased body temperature, thermogenesis. Drinking Celsius and then going into motion is double dipping. You're accelerating the burn and the results are even faster. Celsius is your ultimate fitness partner. No high fructose corn syrup, no aspartame, no preservatives, no artificial colors or flavors. 100% of seven essential vitamins. Proven in six published university studies. How does it work? Celsius proprietary MetaPlus formula, including green tea with EGCS, ginger, and guana seed, turns on the thermogenesis, a, a process that boosts your body's metabolic rate. Drinking Celsius prior to fitness activities is proven to energize, accelerate metabolism, burn body fat, and calories. Invest in yourself. Drink Celsius. Look for us at www.celsius.com. Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by CV Sciences, from seed to shelf. Form Essentials, makers of the Sleep Aid Solace. North American Herb and Spice, wellness for life. Natural Factors, where great health begins. New chapter, the benefit of nature's wisdom. Yerba Prima, pioneers in internal cleansing. Let's Talk Nutrition, on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. Welcome back, welcome to Let's Talk Nutrition. We are around the corner around the country, and around the globe. And we thank you for tuning in, listening to the show, Coast to Coast, and watching it globally and Coast to Coast. And people listen and watch. Um, it's common. Dr. Bird is in studio. Yesterday and today, I've been working the theme of a, talk, really, a, generally a toxic planet, the body burden of chemicals that we carry around. Most people are unaware of the body burden of chemicals in their body. Uh, they, they just, they're not. Because um, it doesn't feel like anything. It doesn't feel like um, something is wrong until something goes wrong. And I was looking for, and I wrote a series on We Live in a Toxic World. It was made up of like four or five parts. In one of the articles, I wrote th this conclusion. Given the extent to which synthetic chemicals are found in drinking water, soil, air, food supply, consumer products, and home pesticides, it is plausible to believe the assertion that all humans are currently exposed to synthetic toxic chemicals. I wrote that there will most likely come a time when going to the doctor will involve a routine biologic monitoring, also called biomonitoring, to assess the extent of a patient's body burden and the kinds of chemicals and metabolites, metabolites are breakdown products, mm -hmm. contributing to, um, to his or her synthetic chemical body burden, close quote. The concept of body burden, I wrote, is real and empirical in that it can be measured. It is not just some abstract idea to talk about synthetic chemicals containing, contaminating humans. Rather, it is a concept that has great health implications for all individuals as they move through the lifespan. It is now understood and confirmed by scientific research that synthetic chemicals tend to accumulate in fat tissue, blood, and organs of the body, are passed through the body in the breast milk, urine, feces, um, semen, hair, nails, and if allowed to accumulate, will have a profound and negative impact on a person's health and wellness, close quote. I wrote that a while back. It's as relevant today as it was when I wrote it. Uh, that's the condition, that's the context of our lives. Context is everything. You think you may be healthy, you may try to be healthy, but if you're situated in a contaminated, potentially disease-promoting environment, what? I mean, that doesn't, that doesn't work. In spite of all your best efforts, you still are vulnerable. And it 
it can also, the situation can, can be exasperated also with mental stress, trauma, and the type of job that you may be doing or experience you're going through. And even if you're eating, trying to eat organic foods, but you're surrounded by all these chemicals, your body will break down. It'll, there will be a time where you just can't handle it. And it's, it's very critical, as Doc says, to take care of your immune system first. It's the first line of defense. It's the I call it the sentinel of your body. Mm-hmm. Mindful, it took millions of years for that immune system to develop. Mm-hmm. It's complicated. And as you age, it tends to become a little more, it's not quite as vigilant. It's not, <laughs> it's not quite <laughs> as, uh, uh, it doesn't quite have the ability to react with the kind of expediency and speed that it once did. It's not quite as effective in uh, fighting off some mounting disease process caused by microorganisms of pathogenic of one sort or another. It's remarkable. Um, once your immune set, once you shut that, eight, we've learned a lot about from patients who suffer from HIV. Once your immune system, those patients are susceptible to everything. And once your immune system is down and it's out, you're a sitting target. It's only a matter of time. That's right. Um, Silver Biotics actually has three HIV science studies. It can help restore the immune system even in an HIV patient. 877-897-8255, 877-897-TALK. I try mightily, I, I don't know if I succeed at it, to take things out of the abstract and try to make them as concrete as possible. I, sometimes the data, you know, data are, abs- are just abstract. They're numbers <laughs> mm-hmm. they're, or they're people's words, narratives. And you got to make that data alive so it resonates and this is not, these are not abstractions. These are hardcore, concrete, empirical realities that I'm sharing with you. Not intended to scare, but intended to inspire people to try and think, at least think about it. The problem, Dr. Bird, is that if you get hit by a car, you know immediately. <laughs> yes. <laughs> right? <laughs> the problem, if you get hit by a, by a pathogenic microorganism, you may not know right away and it can linger and live in your body for decades with some cancers some of these viruses that cause cancer H- hpv 16 for uh-huh. can live in your body for decades that's right and you not know it it's an unwanted uh resident in your that's body right. that's right this goes on all day long and people walk around not knowing so the intended here the intention is not to scare but to educate and to make us aware. That's what we're trying to do. Absolutely. So you have to you have to create your own immune arsenal in your house, whether it's what you eat, what you clean your house with, the uh, using maybe buying more cotton clothes. There's so many synthetics even in our clothes. It's everywhere. But instead of getting worried about it, just take a good amount of products and uh, listen to what Dr. Garko says. So uh, Katie's relatively new to the show. When you hear this, con- I'll get, I want to get your reaction when we come back. When you hear this kind of conversation, does it sound like a bunch of people wearing aluminum foil hats that are a little peculiar? <laughs> I wonder how you see what's, what we're saying and how you interpret it and what it means to you. You can be honest. We'll be right back. sluggish when you wake. It's non-addictive, completely natural, and leaves you feeling energetic and ready to take on the day. 
To place your order, to find out where to find Happenall in your area, call 1-800-243-5242. 800-243-5242. Or visit us at oreganall.com. 1250 WHNZ. Online at whnz.com. On your phone with the iHeartRadio app. And on hundreds of devices like Alexa, Google Home, Xbox, and Sonos. And iHeartRadio station. Win your way to our 2019 iHeartRadio Music Festival and $1,000 to spend while you're in Vegas. T-Mobile Arena here in Las Vegas. More than 30 of the biggest music superstars handpicked by iHeartRadio. Hosted by Ryan Seacrest. News on 1250 WHNZ. A Seminole County jury has sentenced 30-year-old Grant Amato to life in prison without parole for murdering his parents and his brother. Prosecutor Stuart Stone argued for the death penalty. When you consider the brutality, the sense that you should vote in this case is the death penalty. Investigators say Amato murdered his family after they kicked him out for spending $200,000 on a Bulgarian webcam model. A Pinellas County man is one of over a dozen accused of killing members of a protected species. The Fish and Wildlife Commission says Sherrod Strauder of Clearwater killed gopher tortoises to sell on the black market. Residents are urged to stay away from a swimming spot in Bay County. Health officials say the water in Watson Bayou is not safe after hundreds of thousands of gallons of raw sewage leaked into it over the last few months. With Florida's News, I'm Chris Trankman. From the 1250 WHNZ Florida Central Credit Union Auto Loans Traffic Center. Still have a wreck in the left lane of the ramp from northbound I-75 to US 301 in Manatee County. In Hernando County, there's right lane construction northbound on I-75, south of the Sumter County line. Have a crash on Twin Lakes Boulevard at Bush Boulevard and a wreck on Hudson Avenue at Pavilion Drive. See traffic problems? Call the injury firm of Abrahamson and Edward Hillsborough Traffic Tip Line at 866-545-9595. This report is sponsored by the Florida Department of Transportation. Hey you, the one who just thought about checking your phone. How about don't? That text or unread notification can wait until you get there. Did you know you can now be stopped and ticketed for texting and driving in Florida? So put that phone down and focus on driving. Pros like you do it right by buying in bulk to save time and save money too. Lowe's is here to help by having the right quantities of the supplies you use most in stock and ready to go when you are. And at the right prices. Like 30% off Sacrete or Quickrete 80 or 90 pound bags of concrete when you purchase a pallet or more. Plus, save up to 12% when you buy three or more identical Signature Series A.O. Smith water heaters. Whatever you need to get the job done right, do it right for less. Start with Lowe's, U.S. only. Welcome to Office Depot. How can I help you? We're getting her organized for back to school. Yep, got my green notebook and folder for chemistry. I mean, science is always green because, of course. Right, because math always has red notebooks. Right, because blue notebooks are for English. English. And, and yellow, yellow are for, for social, social studies. studies. And, and purple, purple is, is for music. music. And, uh, uh are, are we, we twins? twins? Uh, no. Get everything on their list from the advisors at Office Depot Office Max. This week's doorbuster, one-inch binders for $1. $1 in-store or online at officedepot.com. Limit 10. From the Weather Center, Abrahamson and Uterwick, theinjurylawyers.com. Drive safely. Pinellas Hillsboro. Your Tampa Bay area forecast, a 50% rain chance this afternoon as showers move inland, high 90. Another muggy night tonight, low 80. 50% rain chance Wednesday, high 89. For more news, weather, and traffic, tune to WFLA at 94.5 in St. Pete, 105.9 in Tampa, or 99.1 in Newport Ritchie. This report is sponsored by Ashley Home Store. Ashley Home Store Summer Sleep Sale is going on now for one week only. Hurry in and save up to 30% or get no interest for 72 months with no minimum purchase. Only at America's number one furniture and mattress store. Ashley Home Store, this is home. Dana Lash and the Dana Show on 1250 WHNZ. Seriously, I just don't, I don't even care. Stop. Just stay out of my pocket. Stay out of my business. But I have all these people who are like, what? You stay out of our lives. Stop. No one cares. I'm not trying to be harsh. I'm not trying to be ignorant. But have you seen how much laundry I have to do? I don't even know what the hell I'm making for dinner tonight. I'm more concerned if you like Nickelback. The Dana Show. Weeknights 10 to midnight on 1250 WHNZ. Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by American Biotech Labs, your daily immune system support. Ridgecrest Herbals, take your health to a higher elevation. Ancient Nutrition, nutrition for a modern world. 
Reviva Labs, the natural skincare authority. Let's Talk Nutrition on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. Welcome back. Welcome to Let's Talk Nutrition. Thanks for tuning in today. We're around the corner, around the country, and around the globe. Dr. Sally Bird is in studio. And um, I'm going to switch gears a little bit. I've uh, been focusing on this toxic world that we live in and how to uh, keep your immune system vital and using silver biotics, uh, immune support products. Uh, their liquid, for example, is one way to do it. They have any number of products, too, uh, like the silver gel. I'll get Dr. Bird to explain what that is and how to use that. Um, there is a st- I've been trying to get to it for a couple of days now. Uh, there's a, sto- a, stu- a story about a study that's trending. and I have the entire study in my hand. Uh, FD. Uh, nevertheless, um, it's a plant- plant-based diets. Headline on the study was, plant-based diets are associated with a lower risk of incident cardiovascular disease, cardiovascular disease mortality, and all-cause mortality in a general population of middle-aged adults. That is the exact title of the study. Big title, long. Plant-based diets. Um, I've talked about it on the show. Plant-based diets are diets that emphasize what? A higher intake of plant foods and lower intake of animal foods and are associated, as I said, with a lower risk of incident cardiovascular disease, cardiovascular disease mortality, and all-cause mortality in a general U.S. adult population that was middle-aged. Healthful plant-based diets Diets high in nutrient-dense plant foods and lower in refined carbohydrate and animal foods are, a, are associated, they said in the study, with a lower risk of cardiovascular disease mortality and, again, all-cause mortality and a lower incident of cardiovascular disease. Uh, it can be transforming and transformational to shift to a more plant-based diet. Uh, the chemicals in the plants are our friend most of the time. Yeah. Although you could eat some mushrooms that will kill you <laughs> <laughs> or make you awfully sick. Um, if you see the movie Phantom Thread, um, have you seen that movie? No, I haven't. I don't heard the, of it. Phantom Thread is a wonderful film about power in relation in, a, in an interpersonal relationship. It turns out that food in the film becomes an important part of the narrative and mushrooms in particular and how ultimately they're used in the film in this relationship. I know this sounds really crazy. A little bit. <laughs> it's, worth wa- it's, it's worth watching. It's worth watching. You said Phantom. I'm thinking like Phantom of the Opera and now we're talking about mushrooms. So you lost me. Okay. So Phantom Thread. Is about a clothes designer, a famous world-class clothes designer, dress designer, and um, he becomes involved with one of his, he finds this young woman who becomes one of his models who he ends up marrying. Their relationship is interesting, and it's, a, it's about power in a relationship and how it shifts where one is that was once one up is now one down, and the one that was one down is now one up, uh, and then get then becomes more symmetrical mm-hmm. and th- rather than complementary. It's an interesting study, but food becomes an important part of the of the film, and mushrooms in particular. Back in the day, before we had where we are now, in modern society, people would keep a uh, cooks that worked for royalty, nobility, or you know, high, rich people and restaurants, had a book, literally, that hand drawings of different plants or mushrooms that were deleterious to your health or healthy. They kept a log because it was not recorded. That's, 
that's how food cultures develop. And uh, they, they knew what foods to eat. And it, all this information is passed on from one generation to the next to the next. We just assume in our culture, modern society, I mean, it took us a long time. You go to France, go to the Mediterranean com- countries, uh, Middle Eastern, they have a history of food and it's all recorded. They figured out what to eat, what not to eat, what would kill you, what would help you. Hmm. Right, Dr. Bird? It's wonderful, yeah. We just take all that for granted. Mm-hmm. Our food culture is not of that nature. We don't have a bunch of rules. Why is it that in France they eat pastries, they eat cheese, they drink wine till it's coming out of their ears, and they have a lower incidence of heart, heart disease? You tell me. They eat butter like nobody's business. The food is high in fat, and they're healthier than we are. Explain that. Well, like one explanation is that they have a food culture that has rules and principles to guide them. We, yes. we don't have any. We don't, our rules are determined by fad diets and science in our culture. With all due respect to science, um, it's not the job of science necessarily to establish our food culture. It's also the mass production of more dollar per acre in profits on the grains that are, sir, are grown in this country because Europe still bans food from the U.S., a lot of the things, Doc, like grains. They don't buy U.S. grains. Well, so here's the point. Plant, I'll, I'll read the title of the, he, of, the, of, the, the title of the article. It sums it all up, all you need to know. Plant-based diets are associated with a lower risk of incident cardio, cardiovascular disease, cardiovascular disease mortality, and all-cause mortality in a general population of middle-aged adults. That's it. And I'm not saying that you abandon meat, but more plant-based. Eat more plants, eat less meats. Um, eating, uh, and relatedly, mm-hmm. eating red meat tied to, um, tied to an increase of breast cancer. This is a, new, uh, this is a story out of the New York Times uh, about a study. Research report, researchers report that eating red meat is associated with an increased risk for breast cancer and eating white meat with a reduced risk. You have a comment? Yes. Did they? You don't like that? N- well, it depends on the type of meat. Was it, you know, was it organic? Was it grass-fed meat? Obviously are you, are, are not for this serious? study. Are so you serious? If, if the cows are fed GMO corn, Doc, and they get fat quickly, that is going to hurt our bodies if we consume too much of it. And you have to balance it with humans, plants. Humans do, I agree with you on the plants. Humans do stupid things. If you mistreat the animals in the way that you grow and feed them, how do you think you're going to produce a better product that way? You're going to eat that critter. Mm-hmm. You're going to get sick. That's right. GX.com. Have you experienced the wisdom of nature with Zyflamend Whole Body from New Chapter? Zyflamend is a 10 herb blend that delivers three health benefits. First, Zyflamend is an herbal approach to pain relief, helping to soothe minor pain or soreness. Second, Zyflamend is a joint supplement with time tested herbs to support joint function and flexibility. 
And the third benefit, Zyflamin supports the body's healthy inflammation response, something that's essential for maintaining whole body health. Zyflamin is New Chapter's clinically tested blend of 10 remarkable herbs, including pure and potent, turmeric, ginger, and green tea. Zyflamin is non-GMO project verified, gluten-free, and 100% vegetarian. New Chapter is a leader in supplement quality. Every ingredient, every product, every time. Discover Zyflamin, New Chapter's number one selling multi-herbal. Zyflamin is made with ginger for occasional pain relief after exercise. These statements have not been evaluated by the Food and Drug Administration. This product is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. The ever-increasing stress and toxicity we are exposed to from our environment, diets, and lifestyles make internal cleansing a necessary part of a good health regimen. Founded in 1980, Yerba Prima was the first company to launch a whole body internal cleansing kit. Since that time, they have continued to develop and manufacture a complete range of all natural, high quality fiber and internal cleansing products. By using all natural psyllium fiber and no harmful stimulant laxatives, all Yerba Prima fiber and internal cleansing products can be used over a long period of time to ensure optimal health and regularity. With nearly 30 years dedicated to all natural cleansing products, it's easy to see why Yerba Prima is a leader in the fiber and cleansing products category. Learn more at yerbaprima.com, Y-E-R-B-A-P-R-I-M-A.com, or visit your local health retailer. Yerba Prima, pioneer in internal cleansing products. Have you been putting off a cleanse? They can be harsh and leave you chained to the toilet, making for an overall unpleasant experience. Rethink your cleanse with fluorescence, a daily cleanse that helps safely and gently detoxify your body. Unlike other detoxes that can be hard on the body, fluorescence supports your body's natural processes, helping it to work more efficiently than it could on its own. The truth is your body is really good at cleansing, but due to the number of toxins we're exposed to, it can use a little daily support. Inspired by traditional Obijway formula, Fluorescence is made with eight herbs, burdock root, watercress, sheep sorrel herb, slippery elm, rhubarb root, kelp, blessed thistle, and red clover blossom. These herbs work together to support multiple elimination pathways, gently helping your body's detox systems do what they were made to do, only better. Forget harsh extreme cleanses and cleanse happy. Try fluorescence for gentle daily cleansing that leaves you feeling rejuvenated. Find fluorescence at your local health food store. For more information, visit florahealth.com. Feel tired, lethargic, or irritable? Take solace. You're one of millions of Americans that has trouble falling asleep or staying asleep. In fact, according to a national survey, 54% of adults have trouble sleeping. So what can you do about it? Take Solace. Solace is an all-natural dietary supplement formulated to support healthy sleep and relaxation. Solace can help you fall asleep and stay asleep naturally. Formulated with all natural ingredients, Solace is not addictive and won't leave you feeling groggy in the morning. Take Solace an hour before bed and feel the calming effects of this extensively researched sleep and relaxation aid. For more information on Solace, call toll-free 877-533-7066 or visit takesolace.com. That's 877-533-7066 or take solus.com. Look for Solace in your local health and nutrition store. Solace for a good night's rest naturally. Let's Talk Nutrition is brought to you by Jaro Formulas, superior nutrition and formulation. Natural factors where great health begins. Kyolic, aging makes the finest garlic truly odorless. Celsius, live fit. Flora, 100 years of herbal wisdom. Let's Talk Nutrition on the web at letstalknutrition.com. We're back from the break, so let's rejoin Dr. Michael Garko. And here's the LTN health question of the day. True or false? Okay. Plant-based diets are associated with a lower risk of incident cardiovascular disease, cardiovascular disease mortality, and all-cause mortality in a general population of middle-aged people. Is that true or false? Here's the number to call. 877-897-8255. That's 877-897-TALK. That's easy. I gave you the answer 10 times. <laughs> I would be remiss if I didn't tell you about this new product from Silver Biotics. I'll let Dr. Bird ex explain you what it's about. It's um, 
It's a CBD skin cream, and then we have a caller in Tampa. What's okay, this? Okay, we what's had a product? lot of people calling in the company. They wanted to know if we could mix CBD with silver. So what they did, Doc, is they took the healing cream base. So there's hyaluronic acid in it, organic coconut oil, a little bit of vitamin E, and uh, a lot of silver in it to drive the CBD deeper into the body quicker because of the frequency of the silver. And there's 300 milligrams of pure hemp oil, which nets 100 milligrams standardized CBD for pain management in the product. And it's a reasonable price. It's in a travel-friendly size. And people are getting good results if they put it on the back of their neck, on their knees, and on their feet. That's been the common feedback we've gotten so far. It's, uh, it's called, uh, it's a Silver Biotics brand. CBD skin cream infused with silver soul and hyaluronic acid. Silver soul is the trademark. It's the patented technology of the silver biotics product. And it's, it's a brand new product. Go to Tampa, Florida, and uh, we have a, a listener who has a question for Dr. Bird. Dell, welcome to the show. What's your question? It's about a couple of products of hers that I can't find. And I wonder if it's still on the drawing board or if it's available. And that's the dry mouth lozenge and the toothpaste with the whitening agents. The lozenges are, Yeah. she's holding up a bag. There it is. Silver lozenges. Yes. It's called silver lozenges with Manuka honey. Yes. I got one in my mouth, yes. as a matter of fact. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> they should be available at your local natural food store and many of the chain stores. I've been going to Vitamin Discount Center. and they Ask they, them to order it. They can order it. The one on Church Street has it in stock all the time. And the uh, uh, toothpaste with whitening? Yes, they can order it. They have it. They can, they can order it easily. Mm-hmm. I will inform them. Thank I I much. I don't use that every day. I use it like use every them. other day, every two days, because the, it, it will. Uses? Huh? What's that? Which product is it that you're talking about? The toothpaste, the whitening, oh, okay. the whitening toothpaste. Okay. Um, because it has abrasions in it that will take mm -hmm. off the the the, um, the staining. You don't want to do that every day. So I and then sometimes then you have the tooth gel that you can just put inside your mouth and, and I also add it with my toothpaste. I add the tooth gel to my toothpaste <laughs> and I also add the whitening toothpaste to my regular toothpaste. I mix them. Yeah, I know. Or you can use the tooth gel as you just apply it and leave it there. So your gums are healthy and it's like an active immune system in your mouth. So there are two tooth there are two products. The tooth gel and the whitening toothpaste, so we're not confused. Mm -hmm. Right, right. And the uh, t tooth gel I, I normally use before I go to bed, brush my teeth, and then leave it. Yeah, Perfect. good idea. Perfect. Good idea. Thank you very much. Great show. Oh, thank you. We appreciate you, Dell. Let's go to let's go to Oldsmar instead of Newsmar. <laughs> Hi, Carrick. Nice, to, Hello, nice Tom. to see your nice to see your name up on the screen. Where have you been? I've been listening to you. <laughs> <laughs> we appreciate that. So that, that long statement that I read, plant-based diets are associated with a lower risk of incident cardiovascular disease, cardiovascular disease mortality, and all-cause mortality in a general population of middle-aged adults. That statement is true or false. What is it? True. It's, true. It is true. And... I don't advocate for people, listen, it's, here, it's unrealistic for me to come on air and say to people, stop eating meat. I would have to have the IQ of a salamander to do that. Yeah, uh, but I'm a vegetarian. We, we, have a, we use most, most of the time vegetables. Yeah. Uh, are you of Indian descent? Yes. Yeah, we, Dr. Bird's sitting over here yeah, praising love Indian. Indian food. She loves Indian food. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're going we, to Baltimore. We, we're going to. He was talk. He was talking about silver. We eat sweet, which has a silver on it. Yes, you do. You know? Yes. Yeah. Are you familiar with them? Yes. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Carrot, how old are you? Uh, I am seventy-two. Oh my land! You're a young guy. <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> 
You, you work at taking care of yourself, don't you? Yes, I do. I do. Mm-hmm. Most, most of the time. Most of the time. You know what? If you do something that's good most of the time, you're better off in the end not doing it at all none of the time. <laughs> agree, agree, agree. All right. 100%. Congratulations. You won a $25 supplement gift card. Thank you for your listenership. Thank we, you. Thank you for your show, and we appreciate that. We, it's, it's a privilege to do it. Thank you. Uh, so I have to ask Katie. You're sitting over there, and you're listening to this conversation that we've had about Air, the, the toxic planet. Do we sound like a bunch of people that are, you know, fringe personality, uh, suffering from some sort of personality disorders um, <laughs> that are crazy, doing crazy talk? What's this sound like to you? You're not accustomed to hearing this. It doesn't sound crazy. It just makes me seem a little crazy for being so unaware of it, in my opinion, like because it's just something that I don't think about. I don't think about food contamination. I I, I've never really had to, but I, I'm aware that I should. So I think in this instance, I'm the crazy one. What about, what about the conversation, Katie, uh, we were having today that the planet is toxic, that it's contaminated? Does it sound, did it sound, does this sound extreme to you? It sounds extreme, but it also sounds very true. I'm, we're closed minded to think that it's not a toxic planet because look around us, it, it's hugely toxic. Mm-hmm. It's again, it's just something I don't think about. Hmm. It, see how that is? Yeah. Thank you for your honest answer. Yeah. You see, you, you, it's something I just don't think about, she it's, said. Yeah, they're unaware. And so that's what we're trying to do, raise our consciousness and remind ourselves that, after all, this is where we live. The planet is our, the biggest yard that we have. <laughs> and, you know, we got to take care of our yard. People take care of their yards. Why can't, you know, just think of it as a bigger yard. Thank you for your listenership. Thank you for your viewership. We appreciate you, Dr. Bird. We love you. Your health is your wealth. Your health is the wealth of those that care about it and love you. Everyone's raving about.